somewhere in Amazonia. Any sign of our men? Nothing here, boss. There are no other entrances or exits to the temple except the one we already know. If they had wanted to escape, we would have seen them. Better that way. They'd rather be dead than try to rob me. Yes, sir. I can prepare another group to... Quiet! Someone is coming. Doc, you were right. Here's an entrance. Fantastic! Wait until we get there. I know those voices. It is the crew of the SS Adventure. Don't worry, boss. This time I'm going to make it clear who got here first. No. Gather the men and stay hidden. Let's see what they do. As you wish, boss. Oh, great. Another empty cave. You shouldn't go so far, Capitan. Doc said that there could be landslides. Or traps. There's nothing here, Miguel. Least of all, traps. I don't understand. According to my father's diary, this should be the place. Such a long travel for nothing. 8,411 nautical miles and a lot of adventures, Captain. Of course. How to forget the situation with the cannibals? Or those guys from the strange cult, Captain. Or when our ship was stolen. These are the exact coordinates. The Golden Idol should be here. So much studying. A whole life dedicated to this. Well, you may not have found any treasure. But at least you have us. Right, Doc? <sighs> Capitan, I think Doc is about to have a heart attack. Hey, honey, you should relax. For the umpteenth time. Don't call me honey! Uh oh. Ah! Harrison! I told him not to go far. Harrison! I'm fine! Hey, Doc! I think I found that little golden doll you've been looking for. I knew it! Listen to me carefully. That pedestal is surely a trap. You should look for something of a similar way to replace the idol. Easy, Doc. These traps must have been disabled for centuries. You could ask the guy with the arrow through his head. I think that rock over there should do the trick. This arrow could be useful. There will be time to find a way out. I should get the idol first. I wonder what that is. Yuck. It's just a pile of mud. I'm not going to achieve anything by pulling it. I hope there's nothing waiting to bite me. Three solid gold coins. Now that's what I call making a good bet. I'm going to take them as compensation for the blow I took earlier. If I get stuck here, I'll paint a face over it and we'll be best friends. Oh 
yes. Here comes the Easter egg everyone was waiting for. Great. Now that I have the idol, I won't be able to find a way out. At least until I get that door open. Perhaps if you place the correct weight on the pedestal, you will be able to open it. Let's see what we have here. A lighter! And it still has some charge. Let's see how this goes. A perfect match. I'll keep the change. Let's see what happens if we cover the rest of the holes with mud. Done. Now I have a muddy skull. Yay. Maybe this will work. Not only was it unable to hold water, all the mud has also come off. Done! Well, desperate times call for desperate measures. Unbelievable! The charge in the lighter was just enough to dry the mud. Nice vase, Captain! Did he find a Tolueca vase? No. He made one out of a skull and mud. Oh. That is... disgusting. In theory, this cannot fail. Perfect. Not a drop is leaking. All right. Here goes nothing. Phew. Perfect. Miguel! Your command, Captain? I'm going to look for an exit. If you don't hear from me in an hour, it's because I need help. All right? All right, my Captain. Damn it. If there was ever a way out of here, it has already been swallowed by vegetation. This may be useful. I'm not going to like this any more than you, buddy. Whoops. I completely destroyed his hand. And I also broke the rock. You won't need this anymore. We thought you were trying to find your way out. Yeah, about that. The only thing that I found was another corpse. All right. I'm going to bring the rope from the ship. That's two days to get there and back, so... Try not to die in the meantime, Captain. Hold on, Miguel. Maybe I can find a way to get out of here sooner. I'm not going to achieve anything by pulling it. I hope I'm not too rusty with this. Great! The vine is much longer than I expected. Over, under, around and through. Meet Mr. Bunny Rabbit, pull and... Boom! Ready to launch. Aha! I think I have a new favorite toy. I'm coming out! 
Make some room when the arrow sticks, pull the vine to get me up. Is that clear? I'll take that silence as a yes. Oh, for heaven's sake. I haven't climbed a rope since high school. After a while... Please! My arms are killing me! Unbelievably later. Professor Weaver. I should have known something was wrong. I am glad to see you too, Captain. What are you doing with this thug? A man with no moral compass can always be useful. You've been around the world, Captain. You should know this sort of things by now. What have you done with Doc and Miguel? Do not worry, Mr. Queen. Your colleagues are being well looked after. I still can't believe it! How could Weaver steal the idol from us like that? Excuse me, Doc, but... Weren't we stealing it from the temple? That's not... That's not the same! That idol belongs in a museum! Really? How curious! I thought it belonged to the Tolueca. Shut up, Miguel. Can't you do your own research and stop following us around? Follow you? We have been here for weeks! You have arrived just in time for our retreat. In fact, I think you've met some of my men down there. At least now I can rest assured that they didn't run off with my treasure. But that's... it's impossible! The vegetation on them was many years old. Mr. Quinn, I am surprised. Didn't your lady friend tell you about the powers of the Idol of Souls? The powers? Poor fool. You didn't even know what you were looking for. Don't worry, Captain. Come with us, and you can ask all the questions you want to your sweet doctor. I'm not going anywhere with you. Set my friends free. All right, Mr. Queen. If you don't wish to cooperate, we will have to convince you. Mr. Mice, present your arguments to the man. Wait a minute. There's no need to... Thank you.